Adults listen to music for an average of 18 hours a week, with some people reaching more than double that. Now, does what you listen to really affect your day-to-day -day life? I'm gonna listen to Christian music for a straight 24 hours, and I'm gonna tell you the five points I have taken away from this experience. All right, I got my plug-in headphones right here. We're gonna plug these bad boys in, because if I did my AirPods, they would die on us, and the challenge would be broken. And it's currently 10.30, so I'm gonna be putting in and this in my ear for a full 24 hours and we're gonna be listening to Christian music. So let's let's start the timer, let's do it. This challenge is still going guys. Uh, I still have to do everything that I need to in a day. And so my sister asked me to go get her coffee and a muffin as she's working at the hospital. So let's go do that. I also have to go mail a letter to my grandma because she gave me an awesome Christmas gift, so I have to give her a thank you card. So, let's go. We got the goods from Summer Moon. Okay, so I got a peppermint mocha moon, and my sister got a mocha moon latte, and then I also got her a blueberry muffin. So, she's gonna be happy at work, and I'm a good brother, apparently, you know? Can I get a little clap in the comment section saying I'm a good brother? Life's pretty good when you got your latte, you're listening to Christian music, it's a good combo. There she is. Here you go. <laughs> you're welcome. Thank you. Did you get something? Yeah, I got a peppermint mocha. Well, have fun. Have fun saving lives. So the first point in listening to 24 hours of Christian music would be, it uplifts your spirit. So when you listen to music, it can change your mood. When you listen to Christian music, it's it's good to listen to Christian music because it reminds you of your faith in Christ. It reminds you who you're made in the image of, which is God, and it renews your mind daily. And so I would much rather listen to Christian music that uplifts me and reminds me of who I am in Christ than listening to like Billie Eilish and like getting in my depress depression mode. Like why listen to sad music when you can listen to music that uplifts your spirit? I just got back home. I'm gonna switch to my left ear because my right ear is just probably been overused at this point. So we're switching over to the left ear. And the second point of what I've learned while listening to Christian music would be Christian music has a positive influence on your mindset. The lyrics in Christian music promote love, patience, kindness, self-control, the fruits of the spirit. And so when we put our mind to the things like the fruits of the spirit, is a better influence on our mind. Like if you hear other songs, they're usually about like breakups, getting drunk, usually like stuff you shouldn't do before marriage. <laughs> and that's not stuff that we should be putting our mind towards and we should be meditating on. We should be med meditating on the things of God. So Christian music really helps you have a positive mindset. So it is currently 2.07 and I'm listening to Josiah Queen and I got lunch. Yummy, yummy. Can't wait to eat this up. We're going strong, guys. We got several more hours to go. Let's see if we can do it. Point number three would be, it encourages you to spend time with God. When I've been listening to this music, it just makes me want to spend more time in my word. It makes me want to go evangelize. It makes me want to just really just speak the name of Jesus everywhere. So I just love that music can do that. So I mean, if you listen to it, it can help inspire you into spending time with God and Jesus and just spreading the good news. So that was point number three. All right, it is 3.54 and I'm listening to Carrie Job and I'm gonna go work out. We're gonna be listening to Christian music and let's go. I switched over to the AirPod Pros uh, because the wires just, it just gets annoying when you work out. And I'm gonna be doing chest and tries and let's get to it. We finished the workout, it's currently 5.45 p.m. I'm gonna put my workout playlist in the description. Uh, give me a comment down below your favorite artist to listen to when you work out and let's get back home. Well, I just took a shower. I had dinner. It is currently 7.08 p.m. and I'm listening to Brandon Lake and it is time to give you my next point, which is point number four. And that is Christian music helps you to relax and unwind. So if you're ever feeling a ton of anxiety or you're super stressed and you just don't know what to do, I, re I would recommend to listen to Christian music and remind your mind of the things above 
in the things of God because that is what helps me relax. If I hear something scary behind me or in a different room or I get scared or I'm just super nervous, I put on that Christian music and I just let God take care of everything that he needs to take care of and I just sit back, relax, and just know that I'm in his hands. Since it's only 7 o'clock, I'm going to get some work done and then I'm going to hit the hay, go to bed, relax to my Christian music, and I'll see you in the morning. Many hours later. So it is morning. It's currently 10.29 a.m. So we have one more minute until we can take these headphones off and waiting for it to turn 10.30. And it is 10.30, guys. Let's go. We did the challenge. Cue the confetti. Point number five would be Christian music helps guard our mind against negative influences. A lot of the times when you listen to these secular songs, they have to deal with a lot of worldly things. And as Christians, we don't want any part of that. We are holy, we are set apart. And when we think about those things and have those songs playing in our mind over and over and we're meditating on those songs, they can cause us to want to do those worldly things. And we're not called to be a part of this world. We're called to be in union with Christ and to look like Christ. So when you listen to Christian music, it helps influence you to be more like Christ. It helps you to spend more time with God. It helps you not want to do those negative influences, those worldly things. So that's why you should listen to Christian music. We completed the challenge. It was so much fun doing this video with you guys. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment down your favorite Christian artist in the comment section, and hit that bell notification so you know whenever I post. And I'll see you next time. Love ya.